What's up, y'all? What's up, y'all? It's your boy with the truth coming with the helpful tip today. How to tie a tie. Let's get it. I don't normally wear ties, but I figured this could really help somebody. A lot of people younger than me, I'm 31, so a lot of people younger than me have no idea how to tie a tie. And I think it's something that can be important and beneficial to knowing. I've gone to weddings before and not actually been in them and see people, you know, if your buddies are there, one of the groomsmen, then they might be walking around with the tie undone thinking, shit, this hoe don't clip on. What do I do? Well, you know how to tie a tie, right? All right. So what you're going to do is you're going to come in and save the day. Go save the day because you know how to tie a tie. All right. Now, I don't ever wear ties. I have before, but um, either my mom or my grandpa, somebody taught me a long time ago, and I still remember, and it's still important, all right? Because if you're in a wedding or something, stay away from the clip-ons, man. They look, they look weak. You need to get you a real one. So let me show y'all how it's done. You feel me? All right, let's go. All right. So first things first, get that collar up. Take this bad boy off. Just got a off hard day at work. Just kidding. I would never wear this to work. I'd be the laughing stock of the plant. All right. Anyways, so this is actually the shirt I wore on my wedding. I was big then. I'm still big now. I'm busting out this hoe, but it's all good. All right. So you got the big end. Got the skinny end. All right. So. When you're tying a tie, I'm right-handed, so this is how I do it. If you're left-handed, same thing, just backwards. All right, so if you're wearing a collared shirt, which I sure hope you are if you're wearing a tie. If not, you're probably a weirdo. But uh, anyways, what we're going to do, we're going to throw it over. Got this collar up, we're going to throw it over. Now, we're going to leave just a little bit of this skinny, thin side hanging and we're gonna have a whole lot more of the bigger end but this big end will be about two times longer than the skinny end all right now there's a front and back this is the back see how it has that seam all right so you want the seam on the back side all right now first thing you're gonna do take this big end cross it over the skinny end and you want to put it about right here. See how much space I have right here? Not a whole lot, all right? So, thumb, middle finger. Hold that together. Keep your pointer finger up like this. All right, now you're going to take this. You crossed it over. You're going to keep going around the back. Go around your hand, okay? Now, my finger's right here. I'm going to go a little bit more. And I'm going to come up through this hole okay that's why you want to leave a gap in there and you pull it up a little bit and right where your finger is see I'll leave that out of the way but this piece you have wrapped around your finger you want to take this and where your finger is you want to go through there and pull it just like this all right once you get it to this point you'll have a little tail right here on the back side so you hold that tail twist Pull up to get it tight then you can pull on the big the thicker end get it tight get it how you want it and pull a little bit tighter all right now I got the tail this is the thing you want to watch for is with how much you have of your big end and your little end because if you have if you don't have enough of the bigger end down then you're gonna have this skinny end longer than the actual front of the tie see right now I'm good See, got the little end, but it's 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 just right. And on the back of ties, there'll be a little holder deal for the smaller end. You just tuck it in there, and then put that bad boy through there. So it's nice and secure. You don't have to worry about it flying everywhere. Go ahead and pull that collar down. You ready to hit the club. So yeah, I've looked on YouTube a lot and I've seen a lot of videos about this 
and some of them are just kind of boring rich people who are doing them i don't know but business people i'm not a business person you know uh professionally you know i work in a plant but it's nice to know how to tie a tie it looks good it just looks professional and you don't have a damn clip on right here now if you wear bow ties probably can't help you sorry this ain't the video for you but know how to tie a tie man it's worth it go to funeral or something tie your own tie look just add that little bit of extra touch to just look clean and like you actually tried to get dressed and give your condolences and whatever you go to a wedding i mean you got a real tie on man you know what i'm saying like it just make you feel good knowing that you know how to tie a tie because honestly as lame as it sounds there's not a whole lot of people that know how to do it so take that learn you something if you like this video consider subscribing hit the like button for me i appreciate it follow me for all kinds of random videos i don't have a specific niche or niche or whatever you want to call it but I post a lot of cool videos, man. If you like and subscribe to this video, I'll be very gracious. And thank you. We're out.